Welcome to Dodd Gaming 24-7 for another episode of Player Career Mode as Arda Gulo. Enjoy the watch guys and don't forget to subscribe and like the channel for more similar videos like this. If you've been watching the last episode, you realise that we did quite well, and some good performances from our regular. This has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high, and every expectation this game will live up to its billing. Don't miss a single second of the action. It's all live on EA TV. It tends to rain quite a bit in this part of Spain, but an intriguing region, Galicia, and we're here in the city of Vigo. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And what we have in prospect is pulsating cup action. It's Celta Vigo, and they take on Real Madrid. Celta Vigo should get a win, as most games, but however, we haven't, that hasn't been the case for most of the season. Performing quite poor, the whole team has. Oh, look at that. Rafa Benitez. Delivering it. Just the clearance that was called for. Got the ball. Really Offside. Nice ball, but the flag goes up. Offside. Well, he just needs to play that a bit sooner. The pass was definitely on. You never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, I thought he was brilliant last time out. Scored a couple of goals, but it was his general play as well that was excellent. Coming short to receive the ball, making runs in behind defenders. He was outstanding. Really high class goal. What a shot that was there. Alexander Arnold. Modric. Look at Modric. Oh, that's an interesting pass. But in fact, he's taken up an offside position. Played it in too late. Oh, that's frustrating. He just took too long to see the pass. to intercept Modric Real Madrid get the throw in Kakere Tapia on the ball Tapia. Kakere. And giving the ball away. Eder Militao. It wasn't a great pass, was it? Now, who can he play it to? And quick thinking defensively. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Can they forge ahead? There's still danger here. Just knocked it out of there. He must favour the cross. Oh, 
Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Not relying very much on their passing game in a bid to take the lead. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. And a useful cross. And a goal! Brilliant Use goal, brilliant cross. The there we are. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Unai Nunez. Well, let's see if something comes of this. But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Perez, just the challenge that was required, and the counter-attack is on, options available, really annoying for them, couldn't take advantage. A chance to whip it in. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Being pressed here. Well, the hosts, as you can see, have enjoyed so much possession, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. No nonsense clearance. Modric. Alexander Arnold. Immobile now. Oh, a tremendous block. Well, Celta unable to retain possession. Real find themselves in a position of menace. A no-nonsense defensive clearance. And Real pushing to add to their lead. It'll be a corner. Tony Kroos Real Madrid unable to hang on to the ball just wasn't going to give that ball away there it is that will do it for the first half here in Vigo pretty average first half I've oh, got a goal so all happy hopefully another goal or an assist in the next half and win this game Second half underway with Real looking to build upon a positive first half showing. And Kroos failed to hold it. Kevin. Maxence Kakere. 
passing it around as the search goes on for an equaliser. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. And the big news confirmed. Manchester United have succeeded in getting their man, Stuart. Well, I think he's still got a few years left in him. He still looks fit and sharp and still has that desire. What a good signing this could be. Musa. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Real using width to good effect. Real chance. Jose Lu! Chance still on. Well, I was on the cusp of saying he's at it again. Looked as though he might score again. Well, he's certainly looking sharp today. That could easily have been his second there. And fired over by Cross. And putting pay to the danger. Well, he made great contact with that one. But the goalkeeper had his own ideas. And a big match in La Liga to savour shortly on EA TV. It's Celta Vigo, and they'll be facing Mallorca. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Alexander Arnold. Oh, big opportunity. Surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitute. Uh, give me one second, guys. Let me start in the game in a second. All right, all back. Let's carry on for the game. And now both sides will make personnel switches. He'll take this on. Well, actually, pretty easy for the goalkeeper in the end. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. And Celta regaining possession. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Nacho. Options in the middle. Appear to be in two minds. And Modric might fancy it. Cleared away comprehensively. A very timely interception. Well, the fans are driving their team on here, but can they respond with a goal? Time is running out. Promising pass. Under pressure here, Nacho Fernandez. Not messing around with that clearance. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Kakere. Iago Aspas. Well, not away properly. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Might be onto something with that ball. Distributing it well.
Nacho. And a hit with ferocity. And that was a good shot. Stop. And a good save. And with play stop, they will make the change now. He's driven in the corner. Emphasis on the clearance, a good one. And continues his run. They were playing fluid football. Had to be done for the team. Well, took it for the team. Well, he's had his name taken by the referee. Well, he knew he was going to get booked. It's a poor tackle, really. Play towards the back post. Making sure nothing came of it. Kakere. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Rudiger. And on to Alexander Arnold. Alexander Arnold. That takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Now perhaps they can counter from here. No nonsense clearance. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Well, I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game, but there's still time to find that equaliser. And you have to say the crowd have been brilliant. They're still driving the team on. Kevin. Oh, do they have it in them to level this? Crossing possibilities. And stopping the danger. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Bellingham. The referee's whistle, full time it is, and Real Madrid are the side who move on. Yes, it's a close contest, but one I think they just about deserve to win. They did play the more creative football, they did try and press the ball high up the field when they could, and they showed good energy. They're so Dressed in irons, who cares? Just sold a few tickets, racked up a few digits, lovely. Yeah, lads on the way round, few I've been to spare. But I've done most of them because I'm a man. But a few instances, I'll be right there. Yeah, come on, squat party, wear ass, lovely jubbly. Country's gone right down the pan, but as long as I'm an ass music fan, I'll be dare to bring the ass down, lovely. As long as there's old, so, gotta hate all them. Thanks to this jog on if they're long gone past it. Classless. Yeah, lads through the door, ready to market. Few are being the spare sharpies. Diana Gregory Peck, bit of cologne on the chest. Tom Ford, yes. Got the text, postcode address, conquest. Lads in their Sunday best, lovely. Uber outside the crescent. Lads peacocking, no pheasant. Thanks for watching Dud Gaming 24 7. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for more similar videos like this. Peace out.